Well, um, nationally in America and nationally in Canada, because I'm up in Canada right now, um, McDonald's reports, uh, McDonald's Corporation, you know, the, the McDonald's burgers and so forth, the fast food place reports a 30% decline in earnings, and Coca-Cola also reported a 14% decline in earnings. And I'm attributing some of that to uh, the news that came out in Fox News a couple of days ago, and Doug was the one that brought this out, that um, drinking one 20-ounce soft drink, uh, a carbonated drink a day, reduces your longevity by 4%, uh, equal to the same amount you lose in longevity by smoking. And so if you smoke and drink 20 ounces of a carbonated soft drink, you're going to lose almost 10% of your longevity. So if you're going to live to be 70, you might die at 60 kind of thing, or 63, and um, that doesn't sound good. Well, instead of going and spending big bucks, you know, 23 bucks for a gallon of, of soda pop, uh, when you add it up, you know, drink by drink, um, instead of paying $12 a cup for some of these exotic coffees, why don't you contact your young divinity associate, or maybe even start with us as an associate yourself, and get Java Fit Coffee, um, premium roast. My favorite, you know, is the hazelnut cinnamon. Woo, that's good. And, of course, we have the decaf. We have several other specialty coffees. And then we have Pollen Burst, a very safe energy drink in two flavors, one of which is totally drop-dead gluten-free. And then uh, we have a Rebound, is our sports drink, has 100 nutrients in it. The other sports drinks on the market, very famous ones, have two nutrients, or six. Ours has 100, which is better for the people you love. And we have Go Meal Bars, which are very, very healthful bars, non-GMO, organic, gluten-free, and uh, they taste great, and they're a meal replacer, okay? And it's called Go Bars from our Go Foods division, and they're cheaper than these fast food things and healthier for you than these fast food things. Plus, uh, because of all the stuff going on right now, you know, we've had uh, attacks in Canada from somebody. We don't know yet whether he's ISIS or some um, uh, perpetrator who's a lone wolf or maybe some other political entity or just a nut. We don't know that fact yet, but things are going crazy. They're locking down government buildings. They're locking down embassies. And so I want everybody to get that book, God Bless America. Everybody get the book, God Bless America. Get a hold of the book, Energy Crisis, and learn how to defend yourself. Learn how to make your home invasion-proof. Learn how to resist mugging. Learn how to uh, resist personal attacks like rapes. Learn how to um, prevent kidnapping of your kids and your family. And you can do these things. Get, get 90 days supply of your, your 90 essential nutrients for each person in the household. Get a 90 day supply of Go Foods for everybody in the house, each one, and get... 90-day supply of the Pure Works lotions, um, liquid soap, you know, our hand sanitizers, the spray, and the the um, foam. They they work for three to five hours after they dry. All the alcohol-based ones only work while they're wet. That's Pure Works. And then our colloidal silver is kind of like your own antibiotics. And there's frankincense and myrrh from our ancient legacy division of aromatherapy. They're they're like antibiotics. And then of course. Uh, once you get your own longevity um, laundry detergent, you need to get uh, all these things. Uh, we need to be on top of this and be prepared for these things. Because when they shut down your neighborhood, the grid goes down. In fact, this went the grid went down here in Canada uh, for I don't know about four or five hours. I mean, it, it was like crazy. And so we're backing up here to the McDonald's thirty percent decline in, in in earnings and fourteen percent decline in Coca Cola. Guess what they're going to do? They're going all to electronics. Uh, this happened two years ago in California, and now, of course, they almost uh, went up 50% in the minimum wage, and this is what's causing the problem. Okay, so here's what's going to happen. They're going to put electronics in each store now. You go in. There's nobody going to be at the counters to take your order. You punch in your order. You put in your credit card. No need for cashiers, and there'll be somebody hand you your order through a window uh, at these fast food places. This is going to be crazier than you've ever believed. Now, we saw this happen in California two years ago, and this is why California has so many unemployed kids during the summertime, so many unemployed kids during the school year, because they don't hire them anymore in the fast food places because it's all computerized. Well, this is what's going to happen. These places can't stay open with a 14% drop in earnings. They can't stay open with a 30% drop in earnings. They said they have to somehow reduce their cost by $3 billion. Okay, that's per year. 
Well, guess what? They're going to do that by getting rid of all the part-time help and going to computers. So watch it. It's coming. Be sure you get the book, God Bless America, Learn How to Survive All This. Get the book, Energy Crisis, and Learn How to Survive All This. Talk to your uh, Longevity Associate. Become a Longevity Associate. Drink your own coffee. Drink your own energy drinks. Drink your own sports drinks. Eat your own snack food. You don't even have to bake them. They're already pre-done. If you like to bake, of course, Go Foods has all the raw materials for entrees, meals, um, uh, snacks, desserts, breads, pies, cookies, you name it. I mean, entire meals and soups. And, again, they're all non-GMO. They're all non-MSG. They're all organic. And a significant portion of them are gluten-free. So this is something you can do to protect your family in case the grid goes down, in case anything happens. Protect yourself. Don't bet on, don't bet on everybody protecting you. You've got to do it yourself. God bless America, the book. Energy Crisis, the book. Okay, well, we'll be back with Dead Doctors Don't Lie. More truth, justice, and the young give you away after these messages. Okay, Doug, what pearls of wisdom do you have for us? Well, this is uh, one about Dr. Oz, the famous TV doctor. And, you know, there for a while he was promoting some sort of green coffee bean extract that was supposed to help you lose weight. Now, he's an MD, isn't he? Oh, he's a surgeon and a well-known doctor. Yeah, he's an MD. And I say green, uh, uh, the headline of this Fox News story reads, uh, Dr. Oz's magic weight loss cure loses remaining support. Dr. Oz's magic weight loss cure. Yeah, that's what he called it on his show and he said uh, uh there's one of this the one scientific study that was backing up the extracts purported effects now that research has been retracted uh he had to do some explaining on capitol hill earlier this year senators were asking why as a surgeon and well-known doctor that he would promote the use of a weight loss product that are scientifically unfounded even uh, senator claire mccaskill from missouri says i don't get why you need to say this stuff because you know it's not true when specifically asked about the green, bee, uh, green coffee bean extract, Oz cited a study that uh, found people who took the supplements did lose weight. However, the study was funded by the man- products manufacturer, and the panel noted this when they were questioning him. They say, now even that evidence is gone. The two authors who study, or published that study uh, announced last week that they're retracting their study. And in fact, the study was originally done in India, and uh, the, the uh, study was uh, commissioned by the, the manufacturer, a uh, Applied Food Sciences. And they say that, uh, according to the FTC, they say they paid researchers in India to conduct a clinical trial on overweight people to test their dietary supplement and uh, held the, and uh, whether it actually had any weight loss benefits. The FTC charges, though, that the, those researchers altered crucial data in the study, including participants' weights, and they say they you know, also they said the company couldn't find a publisher for the study, so the company hired researchers. Uh, let's see, what are these guys' names? Uh, Joe Vinson and Brian Burnham, and uh, they were from the University of Scranton in Pennsylvania. Had them rewrite the study to finally get it published. And according to the director of the FTC's Bureau of Consumer Protection, Jessica Rich, she says Applied Food Sciences knew or should have known that this botched study didn't prove anything. Oz popularized the results, uh, saying, "You may think magic, it, think it, magic is make believe, but this little bean has scientists saying they found magic weight loss cure for every body type." He's gonna, he, and you know, he probably won't get his license yanked, but he should. Well, we'll see, won't we? Yeah. Of course, when you talk about weight loss, um, one of the books is just kind of going crazy. Here is Hell's Kitchen. The subtitle is "The Cause, Prevention, Cure of Obesity," and the, the reason why. Uh, People get it all wrong is that uh, they think, and the government thinks, and the medical system thinks that being overweight and obese is due to eating too much and lack of exercise, neither of which is true. Um, Actually, Loyola University proved in January of 2009 that uh, exercise alone will not make you lose weight. And, of course, most people, when they get gastric bypass, they starve themselves to lose weight, but then they regain the weight because they haven't actually supplemented with the nutrients that are missing. Well, this is where the Longevity Weight Loss Program, the Healthy Weight Loss Program, of course, um, um, the center of which is the 90 essential nutrients, 16 minerals, 16 vitamins, 12 essential amino acids, 3 essential fatty acids, and then you throw in the ASAP, ASAP, and you'll lose a half a pound to two pounds a month. Oh, no, excuse me, a day. You'll lose a half a pound to two pounds a day, and the magic here in our system is 
as long as you stay on the 90 essential nutrients, the 60 mineral 16 vitamins, 12 essential amino acids, three essential fatty acids, the magic is you'll never gain the weight back because you're supplying all the nutrients to your body to prevent the weight gain. Hell's Kitchen, the book. Hell's Kitchen, the book. It works. Okay, we'll be back with more truth, justice, and the young Jimmy way. And dead doctors don't lie for these messages. Okay, Doug, let's go to callers. All right, let's head to Shreveport, Louisiana, and Reggie, you're on with Dr. Wallach. Oh, Reggie, you're on the air. Uh, yes, sir. How are you doing today? Okay, sir. How can I help you? Um, let's see. I was diagnosed with uh, chronic pancreatitis back in March, and then um, I got a fatty liver and a little high blood pressure. Okay. Um, do you have any history of skin problems, any eczema, dermatitis, psoriasis? Uh, no, sir. Do you have any history of asthma? No, sir. Okay. Any gallbladder problems? Yes, sir. I had it removed about three years ago. Okay. And what about um, any bowel problems? Any irritable bowel syndrome, constipation, yes, diarrhea? Yes, sir. IBS? All the above. All the above. All the above. Okay. Okay. Well, this is a, uh, well, how much do you weigh first? I weigh, I was back in January, I was at 247, and I'm down to 219. Okay, so you, you you should be proud. You're losing a little bit of weight there. Okay, and how tall are you, sir? 5'9". Okay. Yeah, at 5'9", I'd like to see you at 175, maybe. And so we need to have you lose uh, maybe 45, 50 pounds here. Okay, we can take care of that. Okay, and so uh, this is a Shar thing. Ms. Shar, what can you do here for this gentleman, Reggie? Well, he needs, he's got a gluten intolerance, obviously. Absolutely. So I would give him, because of the liver, I would give him the healthy two of the healthy brain and heart packs. Okay, let's start with the two of the healthy heart and brain packs. Mm -hmm. And uh, let's see here. Additionally, what would you do for the liver and the pancreas? Well, the liver needs the selenium, but... Well, you're going to get, yeah, you're gonna get uh, enough selenium uh, for six selenium a day. Uh, how about the de-stress capsules? Yep. And what would you do for weight, weight loss here? ASAP. 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 Okay. So, Reggie, Char is exactly right. You have basically an underlying gluten intolerance. Do you have any brothers and sisters? Yes, sir. Okay. Yeah, they, you and your brothers and sisters have all gotten uh, a gluten intolerance from your mama. She passed it on to all of you. And your sisters, do you have any sisters? Uh, yes. Okay, they particularly need to be warned because they will pass this on to their children. Men get it, but they don't pass it on because they don't carry pregnancies and breastfeed. So your sisters have to worry about it. Um, they and your brothers, uh, your aunts and uncles, and, and all of your aunts on your mother's side uh, need to worry about this because they'll pass this on to their kids. Okay, so everybody needs to be on a gluten-free diet. No wheat, barley, rye, or oats. Absolutely no fried foods and processed meats, no oils. No coconut oil, no olive oil, no margins, mayonnaise, celery, and cooking oils. And uh, hang on. When we come back, we will give you the program. Get your pen and paper ready. We'll be back after these messages. Okay, Doug, let's go right back to Louisiana and Reggie. Okay, uh, 219 pounds, uh, two healthy uh, brain and heart packs per month. That will allow you to have three uh, selenium twice a day, three at breakfast, three at dinner. One ounce of the Osteo FX Plus at breakfast and dinner. Three of the, uh, excuse me, two scoops of the Viante Tangerine 2.0 at breakfast and dinner. Three of the um, EFA Pluses at breakfast and dinner. And three of the EFAs at breakfast and dinner. All would be accomplished by the two healthy uh, brain and heart packs per month. Then I'd like you to get two bottles a month of the De-Stress Capsule. That's capital D like David, dash stress. Uh, three of those twice a day. That's two bottles a month. And let's see here. Also, for the weight, I want you to get two bottles of the ASAP per month. Take a dropper full under your tongue 30 minutes before each meal, and then take a second dropper full under your tongue 15 minutes before each meal. And after a couple of days, you'll begin to lose anywhere from a half a pound to two pounds a day. And uh, all this is designed to support and promote healthy maintenance repair of the liver, the pancreas. Uh, also, for the high blood pressure, uh, you need to get one uh, bottle a month of the Ultimate Daily Tablets. Three of those twice a day is one bottle a month. And if finances are not a problem, I'd also throw in uh, the immortalinium. Take two of those twice a day. That'll be one bottle a month, and that is to um, stimulate the body's production of stem cells or uh, actually stimulate activity from the stem cells you already have made to, again, uh, encourage 
maintenance and repair of the pancreas and liver. Okay, call us every couple of weeks if you would, please, Reggie. Let us know how you're doing, but it's going to be absolutely drop dead important to be gluten free so you can absorb all these nutrients. Okay, Doug, let's go to callers. All right, let's head to Maryland and Zena. You're on with Dr. Wallach. Oh, Zena, you're on the air. Hello, Dr. Wallach. Hi. Um, how can we help? I, um, I'm calling because I know you're a well respected doctor and I've looked at some of your videos, bio, and I saw the Clemson study. Mm-hmm. And, um, and, the and, Clemson and study is I know that you're. Yeah. Yeah, and since I know that you're for good health and nutrition and have helped many animals and humans over the years in preventing and treating disease, Mm -hmm. I wanted to know, my question is, since your products are to prevent and treat sickness and disease, why would um, you have to put a warning regarding some of your longevity products in reference to the, like, proper... Well, that's a very easy question. It's a very good question because, by law, the FDA requires those things. Okay. Okay. These are required by the FDA. Anytime you um, provide a product um, that is uh, designed to support and promote, um, uh, for instance, like the previous caller, um, things like pancreatitis and uh, fatty liver, uh, you have to say, you know, if you're taking such medications, you can't use this product, or you know, if you're using certain medications, contact your veter- your um, physician. If you're pregnant, you know, ask your physician. These are required things and in many cases have nothing to do with reality, but they're required. And so we always put, you know, our feet up to the free throw line. We uh, say what we can say, and we comply with the law in every way. That way we stay out of trouble. That's a great question. Thank you, Zena. Okay, uh, we'll be back with more Truth, Justice, and the Young Jivity Way on Dead Doctors Don't Lie after these messages. Let's head to Texas, and Marion, you're on with Dr. Wallach. Well, Marion, you're on the air. Hey, Dr. Wall, thank you for your time. Yes, I'm calling on I'm calling on a new friend, and I'm following up on a uh, on my on a friend in her blood pressure progress. So my uh, new friend, he's a, a 62 year old male. He's about 180 pounds. He's got a, a kidney transplant, and he has a hip replacement that now needs to be replaced again. And he's got elevated blood pressure. He's got gout. No skin issues. No breathing issues. Um, and so he wants to get on a nutritional supplement, and we need your recommendations. Sure. And uh, he weighs 180. He's got gout, high blood pressure, um, which goes along with the kidney transplant. Is he on dialysis? No. Okay. And he's going to redo his hip tra- uh, hip replacement because that didn't work. Right. Correct? Correct. Okay. Okay, Char, even though he doesn't have any respiratory problems or bowel problems, what do you think his underlying problem here is? Because he's already had hip replacement, and now he needs another one. Mm-hmm. That means he's not absorbing, which means he's got a gluten problem. Yep. And so what would you do for this guy? He's got kidney problems, high blood pressure, um, bone problems, obviously. Well he, yeah. well, he needs two, well, for kidney, two. He needs two healthy... I guess healthy bone and joint packs because he's got all these joint problems. Yeah, that would work. And, uh, and what would you do for the high blood pressure and the kidney problems? He needs uh, Ultimate Daily. Perfect. That. Very good. Okay. So, again, um, two healthy bone and joint packs. Okay. One for each 100 pounds of body weight. That would be one ounce of the OsuFX Plus at breakfast and dinner. Two scoops of Beyond Taint Tangerine 2.0 at breakfast and dinner. Three of the EFA Pluses at breakfast and dinner. And then... And also uh, give him 15 glucagel a day, five at breakfast, five at lunch, five at dinner. All that would be accomplished by the two healthy bone and joint packs per month. And because uh, he has uh, repeat kidney problems, okay, he also has high blood pressure. Uh, Char said I would throw in the ultimate daily tablets. I'd give him three twice a day. That's uh, two bottles a month, or one bottle a month, one bottle a month, the ultimate daily tablets. And um, because he has gout, I would also give him the ultimate enzymes, and let him um, take one or two of those two to five minutes before each meal, a couple ounces of water. He's got to get on a diet that uh, gets rid of all the purine-containing foods, which are uh, things like um, peanuts and, and uh, peas and beans and lentils, any of the legumes got to go. Uh, no organ meats. People don't mind giving up brains and heart and liver and kidneys, so that's easy to get rid of. Some people are sensitive to um, uh, shellfish. You've got to watch that in case that's a possibility. But um, this guy's going to have to uh, be very, very diligent here. Also, there will be a bottle 
wide mouth jar come with each of the healthy bone and joint packs of the CM cream, which is a topical analgesic pain reliever. You can apply that to the joints um, that are gouty, and um, uh, Ashley will uh, flare up and be painful. Also, he needs this extra selenium because of um, uh, the, the um, gout and, and also the kidney transplant stuff. I'd give him a little extra selenium, and so I'd give him two bottles of that so he can have three of those twice a day. And again, the diet's important. None of the legumes, no fried foods, no processed meats, no nitrates, nitrites, no oils, and no, even though he doesn't have um, the skin and bowel problems or asthma, the fact that he has so many different problems here, uh, Char is exactly right. I would throw in the gluten free diet no wheat, barley, rye, or oats. Okay, Doug, let's go to callers. All right, let's stay right there in Texas and head over to Marcus. You're on with Dr. Wallach. Well, Marcus, you're on the air. Um, Dr. Wallace, um, I got a quick question for you. Okay. Um, I, I was looking on um, on the on the box because I like to eat oatmeal, and it says um, gluten free. Um, I was asking, what do you think about that? Okay, uh, to me, there is no such thing as oat, uh, oatmeal is gluten free. I believe it's a word game because the gluten in oatmeal has a different name. It's called gliadin. And so they can say, well, there's no gluten in oatmeal because it's a different name. It's called gliadin. And uh, I know so many, literally hundreds of people who've tried eating these gluten-free oatmeals and having uh, gluten-free um, uh, pizza crusts are made from this gluten-free oatmeal, and they just can't handle it. Uh, they still get all the symptoms of uh, having contact with gluten. And so to me... Anything that is related to wheat, no wheat, barley, rye, and oats, got to go. That includes dry dog food, dry cat food, uh, spouse, kids, mother-in-law, anybody living in the house because of cross-contamination, food preparation, surface, the bed, laundry, couch, everybody watches TV. And so uh, if you're gluten intolerant, just learn to live with quinoa, learn to live with rice, learn to live with uh, baked sweet potatoes and butter. And... Um, uh, we have a great uh, gluten-free cookbook called Valerie's Gluten-Free Cookbook. We have a, a great uh, line of uh, foods, Go Foods, um, many of which are gluten-free. Every grocery store has a gluten-free aisle in it now. So, you know, just don't um, – the consequences are too horrible, okay? You will lose an enormous amount of um, life. Uh, certainly, you don't want to be given, quote, gluten-free, unquote, oatmeal to your kids, um, because they can become very sick and get asthma and eczema and dermatitis and wind up with type 2 diabetes and wind up with lupus and all the stuff. And so it's just not worth it to me to even try it. Okay? Hope that answers the question. Okay, Doug, we have time to start another one. Oh, we sure do. Let's head over to Fresno, California. And Steve, you're on with Dr. Wallach. Well, Steve, you're on the air. Hey, Dr. Wallach, I'd like to thank you for taking my call today. Yes, sir. Um, so I have a friend who's um, he, he has uh, osteoarthritis in his shoulder joint, and he has a degenerative disc, and he's trying to... Uh, he also tore something. I don't know exactly what he tore, but he said he tore something around the shoulder area. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah, I think it could be a rotator cuff is very common. People tear rotator cuffs, so that's a possibility. How much does this guy weigh, Steve? He's uh, 250 pounds. 250? Yep. Okay. And do you know if he had any respiratory problems or skin problems or bowel problems? Um, no, he doesn't have any skin problems, but uh, he was telling me that he has some acid reflux. Has some reflux. Okay. All right. This is a Char thing. What would you do here, Char? Well, just in case I'd get him on a gluten-free diet anyway. Mm-hmm. And he's got all these arthritis. Have, and... Okay, before you go on, Char, how tall is this guy, Steve? He's uh, 6'1". 6'1". Okay, so he's 50 pounds, maybe even 60 pounds overweight, depending on his frame. Okay, so go ahead. What would you do for this guy, 250 pounds, 6'1"? Ideally, probably should have three healthy bone and joint packs. Okay. But if you can't, two. And what would you do for the reflux? Oh, the I would get him the enzymes, and or peppermint oil. Okay, the ultimate enzymes, right? Uh, Give him the ultimate enzymes. He needs, say, two of those, two to five minutes for each meal, a couple ounces of water. Give him four drops of the um, Ancient Legacy peppermint oil in an gla- uh, eight-ounce cup of water, warm water. Let him sip on that through the meal. And, of course, as Char said, ideally it would be three 
of the healthy bone and joint packs, a full dose of everything at breakfast, lunch, and dinner, except for the glucogel, and have them take 20 of those a day, five at breakfast, lunch, dinner, and bedtime. And then call me every couple of weeks, Steve, and we'll walk you through this. We need to know this guy's weight. Uh, throw him on the ASAP for the weight. Drop her full on her tongue three minutes for a meal. Drop her full on her tongue 15 minutes for a meal. Call us every two weeks. We'll be back after these messages. We're back with Dead Doctors Online, the ZBS Radio Network. Dr. Joel Wallach here for Longevity and 90 for Life Crusade. And, Doug, let's go to callers. Let's head to Arkansas. And, Kathleen, you're on with Dr. Wallach. Kathleen, you're on the air. Hi. Hi. How can we help you? Thank you. I had a specific question regarding the Mighty 90 and the grams of of sugar per serving. Uh, I had recommended your product to an older woman, mid-50s, and she was suffering with uh, overgrowth of candida. And although I think the product can help her, I was, and we did order it and it it arrived, but I was concerned about the sweetener, and then I also became concerned about the dye. So address those in terms of a holistic health approach, please. Okay, well, first of all, um, of course, uh, the 90 for life, uh, the 90 essential nutrients goes um, one serving per 100 pounds of body weight, regardless of age. Uh, Secondly, if somebody has uh, sugar issues, they need the healthy blood sugar pack instead of the basic program. Uh, All of the um, colors are natural colors, you know, like beet juice and that kind of stuff, as opposed to red dye number six. We don't use any of those kind of dyes. That's an incorrect word. There's no dyes in any of our foods and supplements. They're natural colors and natural sweeteners. Um, in our OsuFX Plus, we do have sucralose, and everybody says it's a, a uh, artificial sweetener, but it's not. It's actually an ac- extract uh, from molasses. Molasses is about as natural as you can get. Uh, molasses is kind of like uh, crude oil. And uh, it has many fractions to it, one of which is sugar, one's brown sugar, uh, one's turbinado sugar, another one, of course, is sucralose. Uh, another name for sucralose is Splenda, two, two different brand names for the same fraction of molasses. And so, um, you know, everybody has an agenda out there, and you have people who sit at the computer all day, and um, they know that Mars, uh, there's something going on in Mars that's going to affect us all and so forth. And so when, when people say they have candida, invariably uh, the doctor doesn't know what their problem is. 99.9% of the time when they're diagnosed with candida, they really have a gluten intolerance. And when they get gluten-free, all their symptoms of candida, their rashes, their joint pains, their diarrhea, constipation, belching, burping, bloating, all that stuff goes away. And so um, uh, certainly we, we have people who are in their 90s and even 100 people above 100 years of age who use our products for long periods of time. But again, if somebody has a candida problem, um, it's always secondary to something else if it is candida. But most of the time, if a medical doctor diagnoses them, sometimes even an alternative doctor diagnoses them with candida, it's really a gluten intolerance. They've got to get gluten-free, including their dog and their cat and their mother-in-law and their spouse and so forth. And so, um, you know, look at things in that fashion and uh, give us a call every couple of weeks uh, when this lady is using the program. If there's any questions, we'd be happy to answer it at that time. Okay, Doug, how much time we got here? we got about one minute. One minute. Shar, you got one minute. Give a message out here. Oh, boy. Yeah. Well, I, again, everybody needs to start taking, them, taking care of themselves and... You care more about how you feel than the doctor cares. The only time the doctor cares is when you're sick because that's when he makes money. So I don't go there. I haven't been to a doctor for being sick in over 25 years. They don't make any money off of me. I will not take prescription drugs because people die from prescription drugs. And after 8 o'clock at night on these alternative TV shows, uh, there's all these drugs that that are listed under 1-800-BAD-DRUGS. So call, you know, to get money from... If you've been injured or killed, blah, blah, blah. And how do you know that the drug you're taking today isn't going to be on that recall list next week? So, okay, uh, right there, because every, every drug with a, uh, okay, every drug that is approved by the FDA has one, of the, uh, has one of the warnings and one of the complications and one of the possible side effects is death. Yeah. Every drug that's approved by the FDA has a side effect of death. So, so 
take that into consideration before you accept prescription. Contact your Yongevity associate and get the trilogy of books. Let's play doctor, let's play herbal doctor, the passport to aromatherapy, and take care of yourself. Okay, thank you, Shar. Super job. Thank you so much, Doug and Susan. Superlative job as usual. God bless each and every one of you. God bless our troops. God bless our Navy SEALs. And God bless America. Thank you.